You guys, I am totally excited. Look at my first find coming to Savers. This gorgeous Dunian book. The condition is outstanding. So you better believe that's coming home with me. So pretty. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go over here and see. I see a purse and a basket that somebody didn't pick up. So we're gonna do a quick check in here. Ooh, it's a coach. Ooh, she pretty. She real pretty. $24.99. Yep. I do believe we're gonna pick that one up too. Look how pretty the black leather with, ooh, pink satin trim, like a blush. Oh my gosh, it's got all the tags on it and everything. Wow. Gorgeous. And I've got more in my basket that you haven't seen yet. Okay, today's a great day so far. What else, anything else in here? Little Hello Kitty. Let's look in this basket over here. And this basket over here. All right, now let's go look at the purses, all of them. But I'm telling you right now, these two right here are amazing. Kind of makes me wonder if the same person donated them because they're both in equally perfect condition. All right, let's go see. Looks like I got lots of competition going on, but that's okay. I've got some great ones so far. There's a little pink coach, but she's pretty dirty. $24.99. These girls over here, loving, loving life. What is this on the floor? Avon? Avon what? Case and bracelet made in China. Okay, now I'm curious. Let's see what's in this thing. As long as, yeah, it's not too bad. Got bracelets in here. Oh, it's a watch with um, crystals and things on it. That's pretty. There's no price on it. It's pretty though. Not my style, but it's pretty. Okay. We'll put her back in there. Close her back up. And leave her here on this rock for somebody else. There's a 31 gift bag by the Jewel line. And it's $6.99. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. They're having so much fun with the purses. They're getting all excited over a couple of them. They found it's adorable. Here's a Dooney and Burke. But we're not going to get that one. It's a gorgeous leather, though. Put that, oh, the price on that one is, in case you're wondering, probably like between 25 and, oh, there it is, 25. Here's a Vera Bradley baguette style. Leather? No. This is a cute little guest. I like that. That's cute. Little guest satchel style. And comes with a strap, a crossbody strap. Still has a silica packet in it, so little clochette with charms on it. but it's too scrumpled lead right there. Ooh, what is this orange baguette? Ooh, I like that. Probably nobody else does, <laughs> but I do. It reminds me of my Fendi that I have. $6.99. It's not real leather, but it sure is cute. A little bling. And... I like that you guys have been enjoying my hauls after my, my haul sales after I do these videos. That's nice to know. Oh, this is Hello Kitty. 
But I don't see Hello Kitty on it. Oh, there she is. A little quilted Hello Kitty bag. Um, the condition is peeling a little bit at the top. So I'm not gonna get that. There's another Hello Kitty piece too. Right here, what is that? Oh, this is like a little Kindle case. Oh man, it's hard to do, hold on. Okay, so it opens, you put your little Kindle in here. Cute for school, that's like a felt. And then this opens up and there is a little, how cute, photo album. I guess it's supposed to go in there. We're gonna put that back. You put like your wallet stuff in here. I'm not gonna get it though. Although it is very, very cute. Okay, put you back on there. And back you go. Here's a bright one. But uh, I'm not gonna get it because I have a black Brighton hobo at home. And the wear on this one is, um, it's a different kind of wear that I love wear, but not this kind. Bagalini, pretty blue. Vintage eel skin. I sold lots of these, so I'm not gonna pick them up anymore because I'm not sure they're still on demand. The Dooney and Burt Frost body. Nylon. I'm not gonna get that one. guess speedy style guess but it's missing one two rhinestones on it right there and right there other than that it's in really good condition cute pink interior I'm not gonna get that one either because of the rhinestones. There's a very fake Michael Kors. Eesh. Really cheap. Bikers. Okay, let's see. Here's the Victoria's Secret. That's pretty. Studded Victoria's Secret with a chain crossbody. 25 bucks. It's not even real leather. So I'm gonna pass on that. What is this guy down here? That's a Walmart bag. That one came from Walmart. B. Mikowski. look and see if there's any good wallets. You guys remember these little cuties, the little lipstick holders? The checkbook holder on leather. Who are you by? You are by Rolf. Mustang, it says. Isn't that a deal on that purse? I wish we could get it. <laughs> 
that is real leather. Oh, it's a Gianni Bernini. Oh, kind of dirty. Pass on that one. You guys, again, I am stocked on wallets. If anybody's looking for a specific one, please let me know in the comments what wallet you're looking for because I have tons again. No Chanel, no Louis Vuitton, not stuff like that. That's cute. Because one thing I'm noticing is um, I do have authentic pieces, but nobody's willing to pay authentic prices. <laughs> So I'm not selling them online through through my YouTube anymore. Um, I actually have my authentic pieces online, but I'm not giving away that information. Sorry, guys. But yes, they are definitely online now, and I've sold them that way. It's just a hassle trying to do it through YouTube, uh, the, the authentic pieces. Cute little vintage coin, red coin purse. Is it leather? Feels like it. It's only two pockets. That's cute though. Oh, and there's a little zipper up here. Doesn't have a name on it, but it is genuine leather. save it for somebody else. Yeah. Looks like a fossil, but it looks like but it's actually a relic plastic. That's genuine leather. Oh, Ariel's a good name. I got a really cute um, crossbody by them, but I don't know if this is a bag anybody would actually be interested in. It's all genuine leather. Color block, taupe and black. Pretty cute though. But I'm gonna pass. Oh, oh, that'll come off. I'm gonna pass on that. You guys, look at this Bible. It's from 1749. It's amazing. I don't know what the price is on it, but wow. It's in the jewelry cabinet. In case you want to look at jewelry, I'll kind of scan you through a little bit. <clears throat> I know some of you really love your jewelry. And sometimes I forget to look over here. And here's a couple wallets down here. There's a... I don't know if that Louis is real. I guess I can check it out. I did get a real Louis. Exactly like that one here. There's a little Sparkle Kate Spade, a Fossil, and a Gianni Bernini. I'll check out that Louis and see if it's real. I can't tell what they're asking for it, but we'll see. Uh, a bunch of sunglasses. That nothing really great though. And then I'll take you over. Silver is right here. It's expensive. $50 for that little crystal bracelet right there. And that little ball chain, which is looks really small, is 10. And then down here is some necklaces. That leaf one's pretty for $4.99. And then we've got these big guys down here. Big old elephant for $7.99. Almost looks like a Mandela, kind of a flowery looking guy. I don't know what that is. Pretty though. Almost looks like a blue sand dollar when you get up close. And over here you got some pretty bracelets. Oh, look at that jeweled one down there. Right there. I want to look at it. It's pretty. Probably not something I'd wear, but it sure is pretty. And then 
little stones that look like turquoise. I don't know if they're real or not. I'm not good like that. <laughs> that looks like a bright maybe. That pink one with the pink stone. I don't know. There's one with shells. Where are you at? Here. Where are you? Where are you at? There you are. Bunch of shells on that one. Do you guys like any of these things here? Let me know if you do. I'll be glad to try and show you more jewelry. Here's an old phone. I don't know anything about this though. It's only $3.99. It's cute. And then there's the rings down here. Watches. Hey there. We are in our car and ready to do a haul. Let me turn down the airflow a little. Turn down the radio so I don't get in trouble with that. And we're ready to go. Okay, today was an exciting, exciting day for me and for you guys. Excuse this mess. We had just been having winds from HE double hockey sticks around here. Pretty bad. So I picked up this leather jacket for a friend. She needed one um, to ride. So we got that. Heavy as heck. She also needed some chaps. So I got her leather chaps because when you're on a bike and it's freezing outside, chaps and leather jackets are your best friend. Trust me. If you've ridden before, you already know. Um, I got myself a pair of jeans. They're really, really cute. Really cute. Uh, 12 bucks. Bell bottoms. I like the one they have like the little hem look at the bottom. I'm a flip-flop girl and a western boot kind of girl when I go out. And look at this little top. I'm going to wear it with it. So it's like off the shoulders, kind of tank toppy looking. Super lightweight denim. Long sleeve. Buttons down the front. Real flowy and sexy for my baby. <laughs> Alright, now let's show you the purses. The purses. I'm going to put my hair on my face for you guys. So you don't have to look at that all up in my face. Woo! The wind's really blowing, you guys. Okay, so you saw this one. I think you already saw the price, so it doesn't matter. What do you want to do? Every time, you guys. What would you like to do? You can, for example, enter a destination, call somebody, or select a radio station. Mercedes. What can I do for you? Mercedes. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Alright, so, this is beautiful. Tote. This tote is gorgeous. Look at it. It's got the hang tags on it. It's in new condition. Silver hardware. Patent stripe on the front with the beautiful silver coach, horse, and carriage. Same on the back. Love the little ties on the sides. I'm going to look this one up and see what she's going for. The inside is perfect. And look at that color. Oh, ooh, girl, that is gorgeous. Zipper, open pockets. No corner wear, no strap wear. Nope, no corner wear, no strap wear. No wear on the leather or the interior at all. Beautimus. Beautimus coach. Oh, you probably might want to see the Creed. You can see the Creed if you want to. There's the Creed. Right there. All right. And this Dooney and Burke. Guys, no, I'm not a Dooney person, okay? But with this bag, I'm a Dooney person. This thing is beautiful. <sighs> Look at this tote. Unbelievably gorgeous. Do you see what I paid for it? I paid $29.99 and I had 20% off. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. This is what makes reselling so fun to find gorgeous pieces like this. 
So it's all black. This beautiful pocket on the front it has something in it. It's got a pin. It's got a nice pin. Money tree. And it's got, oh, I can't say that. It's got somebody's phone numbers and stuff on it. Whoops. And they needed, they needed butts milk, peanut oil, sweet pickles, 48 inches long and 10 inches, <laughs> 10 inches wide. Anywho, come on, Kim, be nice. All right, so it's got this really cool pocket on the front. Look at the side tassels. It's so pretty, you guys. It's so pretty. I've never thrifted this one before. It's got a back slip pocket on it. And then when you open it up, it's like got this flap thing right here. And when you open it, it's got this green, beautiful green um, suede. It's so pretty. Wow, there's a lot of pockets in here. Let's see if she left us anything else. Nothing in that one. She left us another pin from Speedy Cash. This woman went to a lot of cash places. Probably because she had to pay for this purse. Um, okay, so there's nothing else in that one or that one. Woo! Look how pretty. Woo! -hoo 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 -hoo. Jackpot! Jackpot! It's got a key lanyard in it. It's got the little Dooney and Burke emblem right there. Hot diggity dog. Man, this is beautiful. Whoever owns this in real life, good taste, good taste. Okay, here we go. That's just the beginning, my friends. Um, let's see. I found this. This, I don't think to be authentic, but it was so stinking cute, I got it. I had to. I had to. Is this not the most adorable coach you've ever seen? Look at it. I love it. It's got the little leather tassel pull on it. The reason I say it's probably not authentic is because I've not seen this one before. I've seen the patchwork bags before, but not this one. Studs on the top of the strap. There's the coach hang tag. I don't care if it's fake or not. I'm not selling it because I, if it is, then I'll get in trouble. So whatever, I still wanted to show you. Um, what is this? Oh, it's a choker necklace with a... I found a choker necklace in it. Can you guys see that? Let's put it on. How do you work this thing over your head? Ooh, sexy baby, sexy. Hey, Randall, do you like my choker? I think I got it on backwards. How the heck do you? <gasps> hmm. Hey now, hey now, hey baby. <laughs> Me trying to be sexy is like, it ain't happening. I kind of like that actually. That's kind of cute. How you, you wear it down here, right? Mmm. Look at me. <laughs> Anyhow. Ooh. You got caught on my mama necklace. Oh, that does, that goes together real well. Uh, look at me. I'm sexy necklace with a necklace on that says mama. Okay. Oh, sexy mama. There you go. Sexy mama. <laughs> I'm having too much fun today. Anyways, look at the inside. It's really cute. It does have a creed in here, which I will look up when I get home. I'll look it up. But it's just so darn cute, you guys. It's just so darn cute. And I will absolutely use it. I love the denim stuff and the brown leather trim. Okay. Somebody asked me, well, Kim, can't you just say, like, Hobo Denim Hobo and not say the name. No, I can't do that either because the name shows or the emblem shows, so it's still considered not okay. Um, then I do have 
genuine, genuine, the real deal coach. And I'm gonna sell it as a set because it's so stinking cute together. So this is for my little crossbody gals. You will get a super cute crossbody black and like a khaki colored C's in jacquard fabric. It has the leather trim in black and the little card, I mean the little hang tag. How can I help you? I don't want anything. Please repeat. I don't want anything. Mercedes, turn off. What can I do for you? Shut up. That worked. Oh my god, that totally worked. Okay. Anyhow, you know what? It's when the strap hits this little keyboard down here, it turns on. So I gotta be careful to not slide anything against the little keyboard thingamajigger. Okay, so anyways, this is the cute little purse. It's got a nice front pocket with magnetic flap. This one is the real deal, I promise. A zipper top closure. There's the inside. And then let's take this little wristlet off. And I think it matches real cute. I paid separate for it, but I think it's really adorable together. Maybe somebody donated it together. Get back on here, you little thing. <laughs> geek squad, huh? That's what I need. I need to be working for the geek squad. I am a major. I'm a major geek, and I am proud of it. Hashtag geeks unite. It goes on this little thing right here, and I'm not. I'm wasting your time. Look at it. It's so cute. It's got a little heart and flowers on the little um, front. The little hang tag. Don't worry, it's not broken. I just I don't have my glasses, so I can't see anything. Um, hot pink interior and it looks adorable with this so I'm gonna sell this as a set okay not separate but as a set have this sweet little Kate Spade all ready for spring and summer little Safiano leather crossbody looks like a little there we go looks like a little Easter egg and it's got the really pretty Vaquetta leather crossbody strap with pink and ivory and blue and mint green and taupe and yellow on the inside has a little gum wrapper in it this is authentic as well and it's in like new condition adjustable strap isn't it cute bottom it says Kate Spade on the little leather tab here. The material is all Kate Spade and taupe with a slip pocket. And there's a zipper shut. Way cute. Way cute. Um, I picked up two of these in case anybody's interested. I think these are great. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and sell these. And what they are is they're keychains. They got the cute little tassel on them. They're in brand new condition, a little charm. And then these are little card, ID card wallets. So just unsnap this and you put all your cards in here. There's two pockets. And then you have an ID window on the back. And it's really cool because when you get out of your car, you just slip it on your, your wrist. Carry your keys. Um, whatever else you want on there. So I've got two of those, exactly the same. And then, I was really excited to find this because you guys, this one is definitely in used condition and it's in the condition I love it in. I did find another original, the original Sydney satchel in the brown color. Let me see if I can poof it out for you. Um, I'm going to take it home. I'm going to clean it. I'm going to condition it, trim the little strings, 
It's got the crossbody, the matching crossbody with it. But this one is the original Sydney satchel that is no longer produced and everybody is wanting. And this gorgeous cognac leather. It's got a little mark right here, but I was looking at that and this is actually just, it peels right off. So like I said, I'm going to clean it, condition it. Um, it's got the slip pocket right here. It has the feet on the bottom. And then the inside has the original credit card slots against the side wall that shows fossil. It's got the key lanyard and the zipper pocket and then a large pocket over here. This is a very sought after bag. Um, it has got the silver foil fossil. This is like the very, very, very first one because you can tell um, it's got the embossed foil embossed fossil that comes down in a V with the with the writing on it that says um, issue number 1954 and then it's got like three little silver triangles underneath it so this my friends is the Sydney satchel in cognac and I'm super excited when I find them because it's not often that I do and when I do they don't last more than a minute so it's got the double zipper top, little top handles that have already fallen down, which I love. They don't stick up anymore. And yeah, other than just cleaning it up like this little guy here, as you can see, it just scrapes right off. Like, like a little, I don't know what that was, but maybe, maybe mascara or something, but it is coming off. Let's see, it's coming right off. And I'm gonna trim these little strings off the handles and it's beautiful, good to go. Super excited that the crossbody strap that came with it is with the bag. And that's it you guys, that's today's haul. So uh, whatever I have for sale, I'll list below. Um, if I'm keeping something, it won't be listed. So that's it you guys. Hope everybody is having a fantastic day. We are having a really great here, day here today. And I will see you on tomorrow's video. Bye, everybody.